this video is for class 6 mathematics and we are solving exercise 24a uh, this is the fourth part of the video and in this video we are starting from number 10 so let us uh, read the question in the figure given alongside this figure here aob is a straight line this line the value of x and also find the value of x and also answer each of the following questions so there are four of them let us try to solve this particular question so question number 10 okay uh, the figure uh, given to us is a straight line okay uh, where the name of the straight line is a o and b and from o we have one ray coming out right and uh, which is named as p so now the value of this part of the angle that is a o p is given as x plus 30 degree and the other side is given as x minus 30 degree so here i'm supposed to find the value of x right and then solve the four questions one by one so let us try to find the value of x so as you can see these two angles this angle and this angle that is angle aop and angle bop are falling on a straight line therefore their sum should give me 180 degree thus i can write angle aop plus angle BOP should give me 180 degree right because they are angles on a straight line since they are are angles on a straight line angles on a straight line okay angles on a straight line so replacing the values of angle aop and bop angle aop is uh, x plus 30 degree uh, plus angle bop is x minus 30 degree shall give me 180 degree so for the solving it I shall get uh, let me keep this x together x plus x plus 30 degree minus 30 degree will give me 180 degree this and this can be cancelled because 30 minus 30 is 0 thus the next line becomes 2x will be equal to 180 degree again further solving it x will be equal to 180 degree upon 2 right or i can write 2 upon 2 dividing both sides by 2 dividing both sides by 2 okay so we can cancel this and we can cancel this also it goes uh, 90 times so therefore i can have my first answer which is x equals to 90 degree therefore x equals to 90 degree now coming to uh, question number 10 1 I'm supposed to find angle AOP so angle AOP is equal to x plus 30 degree therefore putting the value of x as 90 which you have just calculated plus 30 degree shall give me 120 degree so my answer number 10 1 is 120 degree let us solve number 10 2 i am supposed to find angle bop now as you know angle bop was equal to x minus 30 degree so this can be further written as angle bop which implies i forgot to write this here 
okay i also forgot to write here also right here here which implies right so bop equals to x is 90 degree minus 30 degree shall give me 60 degree therefore answer number 10 uh, 2 is 60 degree so we can go to the uh, next part which is number 10 3 okay the question reads as which angle is obtuse so obtuse means more than 90 but less than uh, 180 so angle a o p is obtuse angle right obtuse o b t u s e obtuse angle and number 10 4 angle b o p is acute angle i hope you have understood number 10 okay let us go to the uh, next question which is question number 11 question number 11 reads as in the figure given alongside that is uh, this figure here pqr is a straight line find x like this before find x right complete the following that means i am supposed to find the value of these three angles that is angle a q b a q b this angle here b q p b q p that means this angle here this big angle and then angle a q r a q r that means this angle here right let us try to uh, solve this question as well so coming to uh, question number 11 question number 11 uh, question number 11's figure uh, we have a straight line okay that is p q r p q r you're supposed to put arrows on the both the sides then we have two rays coming out of q right that is q a and q b the values given to this angles are the first one is x plus 20 degree the middle one here is 2x plus 10 degree and the angle here is x minus 10 degree x minus 10 degree so as you all know uh, this all three angles are falling on a straight line so i can write angle a q p plus angle a q b plus angle b q r should be equal to 180 degree should be equal to 180 degree right so now uh, replacing those values given to us that is x plus 20 degree plus 2x plus 10 degree plus x minus 10 degree shall give me 180 degree right shall give me 180 degree now further solving this i shall get keeping all the x uh, together right and the numbers together right i shall get this line particular line here here you can see plus 10 and minus 10 can be cancelled out because plus 10 minus 10 should be 0 so for the solving it I have to solve this first so adding all of them I shall get 4x 2 plus 1 plus 1 shall give me 4x so 4x plus 20 degree is giving me 180 degree right next line will be 4x 4x equals to transposing this 20 degree on the other side it becomes minus 20 degree and thus I can write 4x equals to 160 degree so dividing dividing both the sides both the sides by 4 we can write 4x upon 4 
shall give me 160 degree upon 4. So this 4 can be cancelled by 4 1 times each and for 1 times and for 40 times. So therefore, therefore the value of x which I have calculated is coming 40 degree. So the value of x which you have calculated should come 40 degree. Now the next one that is the question number 11 one okay question number 11 one I have just finished calculating for x only. So question number 11 one uh, I am supposed to find the value of angle AQB find angle AQB let us go to the figure again. Uh, if you go to the figure AQB, AQB, let me change the color of this particular ink. Okay, I can, I don't want to write with red now. So, AQB is this angle, right? That is 2x plus 10. So, let us put the values that is 2x plus 10. So, as you all know, angle AQB is equal to 2x plus 10 degree, right? So that shall give me 2 multiplied by the value of x is 40 degree plus 10 degree shall give me 80 degree plus 10 degree is coming up to 90 degree is coming up to 90 degree. So coming to question number 11 to find angle BQP if we go to the figure here right angle bqp bqp will be uh, this angle this whole big angle here right which is the sum of this angle and this angle right so let us try to solve question number 11 2 so angle bqp from the figure should be equal to angle bqa plus angle bqp now angle BQP should be equal to 2x plus 10 uh, so 2x plus 10 is the value of this and angle AQP should be x plus 20 right so hence we are getting a linear equation now so angle BQP should be equal to uh, 2 multiplied by 40 because the value of x is 40 degree which you have calculated uh, plus 10 degree plus uh, x becomes 40 degree this x becomes 40 degree plus 20 degree so thus further solving it angle bqp will be equal to 80 uh, this 2 into um, 40 is 80 plus 10 plus 40 plus 20 if we add all these numbers right if we add all these numbers we shall get 150 degree we shall get 150 degree this is how we are supposed to do number 11 2 let us try to solve number 11 3 the question is find angle aqr angle aqr right we are supposed to find angle aqr so here going back to the figure again right we are supposed to find this angle aqr this whole this yellow line right this aqr to find AQR, I am supposed to add this angle here, this angle here and this angle here, right? So let us try to solve this also like before. So going to the solution of number 11, 3, angle AQR must be the sum of angle AQB plus angle b q r right so angle this implies angle a q r must be equal to angle a q b is 2x plus 10 and plus angle b q r is x minus 10 so this further implies angle AQR must be equal to 2 multiplied by 40 degree because the value of X we calculated was 40 degree plus 10 degree again plus uh, 40 degree then minus 10 degree minus 10 degree further solving it we shall get AQR equals to 
80 degree plus 10 degree plus 40 degree minus 10 degree so these two numbers gets cancelled after we cancel these two numbers we can write therefore a q r will be equal to 80 plus 40 which is 120 degree so this is the answer of number 11 3 the 